Hi guys, I'm David and this is Jeanette. Together we are Low Range 4x4 Adventures. For the last few years we have been doing some epic trips to amazing locations across Australia. Subscribe and like our videos and hit the notification bell to join us on our adventures. You can also find us on Facebook and Instagram. the railway hotel in Ravenswood. He's just going to give us a bit of a tour of his establishment and all its little hidden spots. Sounds great. Excellent. So welcome to our beautiful hotel. Thank so you. this hotel was built in 1902. I'm mm -hmm. uh, the lucky six licensee in 119 years. So um, the first owners had it from 1902 to 1950. The second owner had it from 1950 to 2005. Oh wow. And it changed the hands a few times and, yeah. and uh, like you mean. How long have you been here? I've been here for four years and 28 days. Oh, today. Okay. <laughs> so, so I've averaged about 19 years each, historically. Uh -huh. Yeah. So that gives me about 15 years, 14, 15 years to go. So yeah. I'm not sure that I'll make it, but I'll give it a shot. Oh. Yeah. Fair enough. So over this side, here's the old ladies' lounge. So yep. back in the day, ladies were not permitted to drink in the front bar. Mm -hmm. So they were served through these shutters in the wall. So uh, we still use it today. Um, when I bought the pub, it wasn't, wasn't in use. So uh, we've opened it back up. Nice. We don't use the ladies, ladies don't own the front bar, so we leave them there. <laughs> um, and the guys that are naughty, they get to drink out here or leave a bump on the head. So it's pretty good. Fair, yeah, cool. Hey, come on, we'll have a look at some more. <coughs> Just pop over here on this platform, please, guys. I'm you're nervous. Fully, fully on, I don't want it to call the ambulance again. <laughs> <laughs> Just jump right on along. See, isn't it? Seek, seek. Yeah, that's me, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the viewing platform. If you look up here, you can actually see gold in the bricks. Oh, cool. Can you see the gold? Yeah. So there's 340,000 bricks in the building, all locally made. They're made out of Conley, which is a gold field about eight k's out of town. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So lots of gold in the clay. Make bricks out of clay. Here we are. Yeah. The hotel built on bricks of gold. Yeah. So for the awesome. rest of the tour, uh, no knocking off any bricks, yeah, okay? Yeah, this is good. Right, <laughs> Alright, so come on down, I'll take you down to the old mines from the ocean. Mm -hmm. Got rooms reviews last night that we haven't uh, done up yet, so we might have to excuse that. That's okay. So this is our Indian room. So this is our manager's residence. Oh, ha ha ha. How cool is that? Oh my goodness, look at this pie. So this was my daily rider up until I bought the hotel. And I can see it hasn't been anywhere. Mate, I've been so busy. I've been so time. busy. I haven't even I haven't even started it uh, in uh, just over four years. That is that is such a shame. Yeah, it is a shame. Yes, yeah, yeah. absolutely. That is so beautiful. We've got 33 rooms for guests, mm -hmm. and this is the only ensuite double room we've got. We've got some ensuite singles, but. Uh, so if you're staying in another room, you all got to share together. How much fun's that? Oh, yeah, fantastic. Really? I'm not sure this one's made up, is it? No, yeah. it's not, not made up yet. That's all right. <laughs> oh, so these are the rooms, the accommodation. Yes, yes. So this is this is one of the accommodation rooms. Oh, oh yeah, pretty cool. Bathroom. Lovely. So cool. So come on through, I'll show you some more. Can I just take a photo of your bike? Yeah, of course you can. Thank you. Yeah, jump on it if you like. Just don't put your foot through that fifty thousand dollar painting beside it, that's all. <laughs> Oh, no pressure. <laughs> I'll show you this room. This room's quite interesting. Uh -huh. I used to repeatedly hit my head on the smoke detector on the ceiling. <laughs> One day I got jack of it, so I grabbed a pick, shovel, and a wheelbarrow, and I dug the floor down half a meter. Did you really? Yeah. So you can see where the floor. I'd already restored the room, so I just left it so you can see where I where I actually dug it in. Oh yeah. Beautiful. So cool in here, isn't it? You know, it's it's really cool. It's it's really interesting because the the rich people with the big hats, big hairdos, and big wallets stayed upstairs, yeah. and the workers stayed down here. But this was yeah. actually better the accommodation. Best place. Yeah. Yeah. It was cool. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it was low ceilings, but uh, apart from yeah. that, and, and dirt floors originally. Mm. Okay. Oh, yeah. So nice. Now I'm going to turn some some lights on. Mm -hmm. well, another room here and have a look at. I'll just get some lights on in the cellar. Okay. Quite dark in here, so I'll just get a bit of dust before we can win. Alright, thank you. Oh, this is awesome. Did you say how many rooms are here? 
33, I think he said. Accommodation room. Mm. Jackie's gonna love this. <laughs> I think. Okay. Come on through. So watch oh, your heads. Good. And every every doorway's got a little step in it. So you just gotta okay. lift your foot in so oh. you gotta spring your sleep. <laughs> so walk on through. Thank you. Little lip in the door there, sir. So this floor level was the same level that I'm standing on. Uh -huh. It was all dirt floors when I bought the place and it was full of prob probably 50 years of trash. Oh. So, and there were old workbenches and just anything that was broken that didn't work, they sort of basically threw it down here. Yeah. So I, I spent a week and cleaned, uh, cleaned all the crap out uh -huh. and then um, I, I furnished it, but it was just dusty dirt floors and, and it was very low ceilings. Yeah. And actually the next arch, I used to keep clipping my head on that. And one day I thought, you know what, I'm gonna dig this down. So I got stuck into it. So I spent three months on a pick and shovel, in the <gasps> So I do have a dingo and a mini excavator, but I yeah. want to do it by hand. Uh -huh. So the same way as the old times did it. Yeah. But um, I can't take 100% credit for this dig. My wife actually put three shovelfuls of dirt in the wheelbarrow, so it was a joint venture. <laughs> <laughs> so well, uh, once I dug the floors down, I leveled, leveled them, paved them, and then furnished the place. This is incredible. It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. So this is our sitting and sipping area. So come on yeah. through. So you see a part of an arch in this wall? Mm -hmm. So what happened when they actually built the hotel back in 1902, there was not enough land to build the pub, so they built it over the creek. So the creek used to enter under the front of the hotel and exit out the side through two arches. Okay. So this was open foundation. <laughs> um, this internal wall was put in, put in sometime in the last 119 years to stop the water ingress, and then they mm -hmm. backfilled and then used this for cellars or okay. for storage. So when you dug out all the floors. Mm -hmm. Did you find anything really I found cool? lots of bottles. Uh, yeah. I found a 1926 St George Penny. Uh -huh. um, I still got all the dirt that I just haven't had time to go through. Yeah. I've buried yeah. it out the back. Okay. In my little carrying park. So <laughs> one day I'll, I'll dig yeah. it up and, well, yeah. and go through it. But uh, mm -hmm. yeah, lots of old boot soles and uh, okay. broken crockery. Yeah. yeah. Um, I found a beautiful clay smoker's pipe. Um, it was intact until I hit the pick. Oh. And that's right at floor level. So, yeah, it's a bit of shame, but yeah. that's okay. It's, uh, it's all very exciting. Sorry. But I had a bit of game, so I put a games room in. So uh -huh. feel free to wander in there. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> so, as I said, this area is designed for sitting and sipping. Yep. So, uh, it's uh, a lot of people sit away from the bar and drink down here, so it's open for spirits and wine only. Mm -hmm. Anyone I catch with beer, I find them twenty dollars. That goes to the blind doctor. So that's Love it. Cool. Yeah. Um, we did have a few problems though. The place was very well utilised, and uh, people were having a great time down here drinking. But after their seventh three drink, they're having trouble negotiating the stairs to get more booze, so they were tripping over and spilling their, their grog and so forth. So oh, okay. we had to fix the problem. So come on, I'll show you what we did to fix uh, that. Cutlass pantry. That's a very good idea. We actually looked at so many different ideas. Uh-huh. First of all, first of all, we put in a day room. Mm -hmm. So this room here is um, so people that had a little too much to drink can come and lay their head down. <laughs> <laughs> in the old days, they had miners' couches and day beds. Yeah. So this, yeah. Is, this is our day room. Uh, we do call it a rest area. So uh -huh. it's cool, dark, and quiet. Um, please don't confuse it with restroom. That is upstairs on the right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but when I when I uh, when I dug all this out and, and uh, furnished this, I really wanted to build a man cave, but I got a little, mm. little carried away. So I decided to build a man cave behind me. At any rate, after a discussion with my wife, she thought it sounded a little sexist in these, in these current times. So I pondered mm. on long and hard because it troubled me greatly. Anyway, I thought about it and uh, I changed the name to She Shed. So, <laughs> come and have a look at the She Shed. Love it. I'm just starting to shut this door. All right, come on through. There's a little step in the door. Okay. Wow. <laughs> come on in. That's cool. That is amazing. <laughs> Love it. Yeah, that is a, a hell of a bar. <laughs> So we have over 200 bottles of happiness down here. We have premium whiskies, rums, bourbons, gins, vodkas, tequilas, cognacs, brandies, liqueurs, and champagnes. So now we have a new mantra for the hotel, and it goes like this. If you're hungry, we'll feed you. If you're thirsty, we'll get you drunk. If you're lonely, we'll get you drunk. <laughs> this is 
absolutely brilliant. Just what you wanted. So how often do you use the area downstairs? Uh, every day. Every day? Yeah, it's okay. Usually every evening. Yeah. Where, where so yeah, a few people come yeah, in and absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I think um yeah, we will definitely be bringing a few friends over and staying here. Yeah. Yeah, mm. that would be good fun. So Are you scared yeah. of ghosts? Are you not scared of ghosts? No. I've never seen one. Well, then, okay. No worries. The reason I ask if you're scared of ghosts, whatever you do, do not do not go to the other hotel because I've heard it's haunted. <laughs> but if you're not scared of ghosts, this one could be a wee bit haunted. Would mm -hmm. you like a complimentary ghost photo? Yes, please. <laughs> complimentary ghost photo, right well, I'm a bit of a photographer, but that camera's been handy for me to handle. Can mm -hmm. we throw your mobile phone? Yeah, sure. Please. If you guys stand back over here in the corner, mm -hmm. I'll jump out and take a picture for you. Yeah. Fantastic. Excellent. Now, yeah, do you want to adjust your camera a little? No, go for it. Cool. Okay. All right, big smiles. Whatever you do, don't look down. Uh huh. Okay. Um, yeah, you should be okay. It's just. <laughs> I don't want you to overthink it. Just relax. I'll get my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I expect there to be a big blast of cold oh. air up my leg or something. Oh, crazy. You said you're not scared of ghosts, eh? No. Oh, and here on the bar. Can you see any spirits? No. Oh, God. Oh. All right, <laughs> oh, okay. So there's a little more to it. When I walked in, the two old guys drinking at the bar, so we'll see if we can find them. There's a couple of little orbs up there. Cameras pick up all sorts of amazing stuff. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, that's oh, good. Very cool. Thank you so much. Oh. That is amazing. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. I like the way you did that. Very cool. <laughs> so what we're doing now, under the main bar, um, we're digging a subterranean cigar bar. So remember earlier I said the creek runs around under the hotel? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that, uh, in 1985, they found white ants or termites in the culvert at the front. So they, they dug it up and put concrete culverts and moved the creeks four metres, or the culvert four metres sideways so it didn't oh. enter under the front of the hotel anymore. Okay, yeah. So there's a massive void under the pub. So we're yeah. using that now as a cigar bar. So Sweet. So there'll be a little, little, little digging under there, is there? Or? I've been digging now for six months, now, <laughs> uh, And I'm just about, I'm just about broken through now. So uh -huh. another three weeks it'll be done, open. That so we've got so cool. humidors, we've got cigars, we've got everything in stock, ready to open that up and then you can come and get a brandy or a whiskey yeah. and then sit out there and have a good old... Well, the cool here. thing is we're working in Charters Towers till the end of November, yeah, so we should that. be able to come back and visit. <laughs> in fact, if you guys want to hang around for a few days, we could probably get out in a bit sooner if you want to jump on the picture. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure there would be plenty of willing workers amongst our crew. <laughs> yeah. So what, are you with the, the um, movie... Survivor. Survivor, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah we've well, got a few here. Actually, actually yeah. um, everyone's been raving about Ravenswood. Yeah. And um, cool. yeah, they've loved your tours. A few of them have done the tours. Excellent. So yeah, I yeah. guess you'll get a lot of our guys out. We've got more people showing up in September. Right. And mm. yeah, they don't get a lot of time off, but this is great for yeah. daytime. Just come out, have a couple of come drinks, right. and yeah, yeah uh, get a lunch. Nah, it's awesome. Yeah, no, that's good. So, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Welcome. My pleasure, sir. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was cool.